lost internet connection. I don't, I think I just ran out of cash on my tablet. But anyways, what I was saying is that you can get level six talent runes, ten of them, if you're free to play, provided that you save up your gems. And it, it it's it doesn't take too much time. It's honestly, I mean those that event and all these other events it's it is definitely worth it and honestly you know here's the thing like whenever i roll for new heroes i mean i just on a whim just rolled this evening for or not this evening but on the release date for creation one and i got him with an 8000 gems but if you go back all the way back to medusa Whenever I rolled Medusa, I got her on the first night, and I think that was on 10,000 save gems. And I think I was down to about 2,000 gems whenever I got her. And then whenever Trixie Trick came out, I bought, prior to the event, I bought probably about $100 worth of gems on three different events or three different purchases and I got nil and I tried for church retreat so hard so hard guys and gals thanks for listening thanks for watching I tried so hard for church retreat and I never ever ever got lucky um, I've got two smurf accounts and my second account got Trixie Treat like a week later. And I, I don't think I spent any gems on my second account for even prior to that. My third account, I spent a lot of gems just to get it up to par. And uh, <clears throat> Yeah, so here we are. I've got a Devo Trixie Treat, and that's the end of that story. Anyway, so if you guys do buy, um, pretty good rewards. 80 plus tones, one augmenting stone, and I always get tricked by this because I always see the, the rev, and I just automatically think it's a <clears throat> revitalize, and it just so happens to be a revitalized set this time um, I've got trick before and it's been a revive and well needless to say I've got a handful of revive so well, let's see what else events I got um, as in the previous video I did smat or I'm sorry I bought five of the $20 packs to get the skull knight um Skull, what, what the hell is it? I don't even know. The Skull Knight. Here, I'll show you guys. Skull Knight skin. So, yeah, that's the new skin. I thought it was ugly as hell, but yet they offered it for 100 bucks. I had to have it. It came with five Skull Knights. I've got... My main skull knight, which is stone skin, and let's see what else. I know I've been boring you guys with talking, just random shit, and uh, I know you guys want to see some gameplay, so I apologize for procrastinating. So as you can see, I've got several other skull knights. They're just waiting for shards. Um. My third account, I've got a, or maybe it's my second account, I'm not sure which one it is, but it has a Skull Knight with a Scatter 8, and I absolutely hate it. So I might consume this guy right here. I'm not, I'm not sure, but it's, uh, it's a work in progress. It, it may come in handy in Fortress Feud or something, but... As of right now, I'm not too very happy with uh, Scatter Skull Knight. So let's get back into the events real quick. 
I do want to put a shout out to my boy Wooly W001Y Wooly. He's been my boy from the beginning since I started this game, and my boy Brad Miller. They've been a uh, epic help with uh, getting my account grown. So we'll see what else events we got. Lucky Prospector. Let's see if we can do anything with this. Oh, hell yeah, we got five chances. All right, what are you guys wishing for? We got that rare Arctica. We got so Damn. I will definitely take a Skelectica because I need to Devo him. We got a Revive 4. And let's see what else. Anubis, yeah. I just devoed mine and I consumed a Stone Skin 5 Anubis just to do it because I don't I don't think there's a, u a use for two Anubises, but here we go. Well, let's see what we got. HB, which I definitely need, and pff, nobody needs, if you're spending a hundred bucks, nobody needs a Maltanica. Please, IGG, change this up. And, yeah, I'll take that. Granted, it's not the best, but... Eh. PD, okay. Ah. Ugly. Who in the hell wants a drag axe? That's an easy 200 gems or 200 shards. And what is that? It's junk. So pretty much the best thing that came out of that was the HP and the the orbs. But IGG, come on now. I know that you want us to spend orbs to upgrade our heroes, but here's the thing. Why not put in there a gem pack that's equivalent to the purple orbs or to the to the to the big blue orbs or to the gold orbs for that matter? I mean it's You're just being greedy, my opinion. Smash and win. Big boy smash and win, possibly. Yep, big boy smash and win. So I guess we got two. Um, oh, wait, hold on. I guess that event's over. I did my big boy smash and win. We're on the 21st. Yep, that event's over. Fall festival phase. Ah, uh, we can do that. Let's do that. Let's see. A demo. Man, I spent so much damn gems in this game. And have yet to get a demo. So, this could be a first. Y'all might be enjoying this with me. Let's go. Sand boom, no good. Shards. Death Knight, nothing. Shards, tree, shards, and you guys may wonder why it is that I am picking just the last one, and to be honest with you, I analyze things quite a bit, and the odds of picking the same location are better than picking just random locations each time and I mean it's scientifically proven it's uh it's just a matter of time that that spot's gonna hit because regardless of what rewards are up there your chances are 33 percent that you're gonna hit the right one on every third roll so I mean you guys can roll the way you want to but whatever it is that I roll 
I pick one, I stick with it. I could have just picked the middle one. I could have picked the left one. I'm right-handed, you know, so I just naturally just chose the right one. And that goes same with the treasure chest, uncover the treasure. Um, any events that you get to pick, like just random different spots. You know, I always pick the the bottom right or the right. And, and as you can see, that hasn't worked out well for me. So maybe your guys' tactics may be a little bit better. Especially when it comes to DMO Gorgon, because he is extremely elusive. Um, let's see, buy gems, dealing and win. I think I might qualify for that, unless I did it earlier. Nope. And of course, legendary. But if you guys noticed, or if you guys do purchase, um, usually on that third day, you will get an additional prize if you purchase all three days. And I've gotten just a regular hero card, not regular hero card, but I've gotten an actual